I've been wanting to film an unboxing video for a while. Um, believe it or not, I am saving for a holiday. Um, so yeah. Um, but yeah, I've always wanted to do this. I've filmed them opening them as I've bought them, so it's all just easier to edit that way. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy this video and here's what I bought. And the first thing on my unboxing video that I'm going to do is this Harry Potter mystery mini vinyl. These are the ones that you can get, so let's find out who I got. Um, looking at it, I'd like Hermione and Crookshanks. Little Dobby, oh he's so cute! McGonagall, and you can get McGonagall's cat. Okay, enough chit chat, let's open these up. Do I need scissors? I'm just gonna do this. Nope, I need scissors. Oh, I'm left handed, don't judge me. I'm kind of weird. There we go. I like to make these like physically indestru indestructible to get into this. I got Nagini! Nice evil snake. Let's see who's in this next one. Oh, it's a person. I think it might be Hermione. Yay! So in the next one, I got Hermione. Yay! Oh, she's really cute. I'm happy with that. Nagini! Ah, uh, she's okay. But yeah. This is who I got. I'm just my parents. I've just had a bath, so my hair is still wet. So hopefully this will like, differ from the appearance. But let's get these open. And the perfect thing to use, of course, would be a Disney bowl. I bought this from the Disney store ages ago. It might have even been in the sale. But, like, it's so oddly shaped. What could you put in it? I don't know how much it is, because obviously the price has fallen off. But, yeah. So oddly shaped, and it's quite deep as well. Might be nice for, like, little snacks or something. I've never really used it. I think Alfie's put chocolate in it before, but I've never used it. But he's still super, super cute. I definitely should have got a bigger bowl. <laughs> but this is who I got. So I got Anna, who is extremely fiddly to put together. Kristoff. Elsa. And Sven. Focus, come on. I thought it might be easier to record this way. Um, because I've just had a bath and my hair's all wet, so I look a bit of a mess. So let's try and get this open. And it's stuck. Hmm, it says exclusive, so I wonder. <gasps> yeah, they're the Walmart exclusives. Oh, we should have bought more now. I think I know who this is. Ah, so I got Madame Garderobe, a Walmart exclusive. Oh, she's so quite cute, actually. Oh, I'm quite happy with that. Um, so the ones that you could have got were Plumette, Madame Garderobe, and Cogsworth is an exclusive. Well, I did not know that, and I kind of need him now. Curse you when I'm trying to save money. Ugh. I really want Belle and Beast and Chip and LeFou because I love LeFou. He stole the film for me. So um, after finding out that the Beauty and the Beast part vinyls were the exclusive Walmart ones, 
kind of went back and bought three more. Um, so yeah, no shame. Let's see who they are. Hopefully you can get lucky and get an exclusive again, but I am seriously doubting it. Uh, you know what I should have done? I should have took the plastic off beforehand. Because that would have been the clever thing to do. So cute. I'm happy with that. These are like impossible to open. Yeah. Oh, I think I know who this is. I'm amazed. Yeah, I'm so happy. And the last one. Who could it be? Oh, it's another person. It could be LeFou, I'm gonna guess. <laughs> My predictions are on fire. LeFou. Wicked. I'm quite happy with those three. Um, so I haven't got Beast, Gaston, it is Lufu, yeah it is Lufu, Lumiere, Mrs. Potts, Chip, Adam, Celebration Bell. So the exclusive ones are Plumet, the Ward, Miss Madame Garderobe and um, Cogsworth. So I got Madame Garderobe yesterday, my ex first exclusive one, in my first try, and then Cogsworth. I'm not too bothered about Plumet to be honest, so I'm, I'm over the moon with these three today. Just need, really want Chip and Beast and I think I'm square. Yep, Chip and Beast and then I'll be very happy, but I am over the moon. They don't do a blue bell, do they? No. So you realise if they did a village bell, but I'm over the moon with who I got. Yay! I'm so excited to sit down and film this. Um, so at work today, I was in my bag, literally not long in from work. I was doing like the um, clip strips, which are things they hang onto the side of the shelves. So I had to like restock them and everything. As I was walking around replenishing these things, I noticed a new stand had gone up. And on this new stand were a new series of Sumsums. I am so excited. I mean, look, little Cogsworth, and like, this is the picture on the back of all, like, not all of them, but some of them that you can get. Yeah, Cogsworth, Beast. <laughs> I'm like overly excited about this. And Mrs. Potts. I am so excited to open these and see who I got. So. I thought I could wait like until I film an actual haul video, but I can't wait that long. So the mystery one I got was Mowgli. Um, they're not rubbery, they're not really squishy like the last ones, these are quite hard solid plastic. Um, I'm not really into the Jungle Book so I'm a little disappointed with that one, but I'm over the moon with Mrs. Potts. I mean. You know they seem to be solid, these ones. Mrs. Potts, how cute is that? Okay, on to the next one. Ah. I got Scar. Oh, he's so cute. I'm really pleased with that one. Look at him. Little Scar. And then obviously there's Beast. <laughs> and 
And then I got, we're fakey. I'm sensing a theme here. <laughs> yeah, I'm, mm, Rafiki, not one I'd have chosen myself, but I like Scar, he's cute. Oh, the little details on Coxworth are amazing. Look at his little wind up key and then the pendulum, like his little arms. Oh, it's really cute. I'm over the moon with this one. So, let's see who's on the list that you can collect. Aladdin, Bagheera, Timon, Raja, Rafiki, Mrs. Potts, Beast, Mowgli, Moana, King Louie, Flounder. I was going to get Flounder. I was so tempted because he was in one that you can see. Scar, Bailey, Destiny. Destiny is my favourite from the new Finding Dory. Oh, you can get Pua. I can't say his name, but it's either Pua or Pua. I don't know. Raksha. I don't know who that is. Judy, Nemo, Genie, Glittery Belle, Glittery Hey Hey, and Glittery Ursula. Oh, there's not actually that many to this series. Oops. So this arrived today. I've been so excited to open it. I was so excited once I ordered it, and I've had to wait like a while for this to come. And I know it arrived while I was at work and I was like, oh my god, I just really want to open it. And like knowing it arrived while I was still at work and I still had work to get through. <laughs> yeah, I've cut the address off, so obviously. And there's got like this Olaf duct tape. And then on the box there's like castles and sparkly ink. They're really cool. So yeah, enough chit chat. Let's get this open, yay! Oh. It's definitely recording now, so shut up. <laughs> So, I uh, I started this video thinking it was recording, and it's not recording. You can probably hear my sister in the background <laughs> laughing at me. Because I do feel pretty stupid right now. But there you go. So this is definitely recording now. So, I've opened some things. Shut up, you. <laughs> I've opened some things. And it's... I, I love them. Um, but I suppose we'll just start again. <laughs> so you might be able to see what some of these items are now. Like, the box came, and it was wrapped in princess paper. Um, so I got a bell shower cap, which is really cute. I've not seen this before. Um, it also came with a card, which I haven't opened yet. Um, these bell socks, which are really cute. I've never seen these before. They're like yellow and stripy and really cute. I can't wait to wear these. Um, ow, something just stabbed me. <laughs> There's a bell uh, lead pencil. I loved these um, so much, like when I was a kid. I don't really know anywhere that sells them, so like, I need them all now. Um, oh yeah, the thing I was discussing as well, like, this is like bits of the story cut up into like shredded tissue paper, which is really cool. Um, I was just struggling to open this before I realised it wasn't recording because I heard the camera shut down, which isn't fun. Um, so yeah, let's carry on with opening this. and a beast go perfect on my display I don't know where I'm gonna put this but I will find somewhere for it because this is adorable oh the rose I actually really want to make like my own enchanted rose bell jar um, I picked up some um, flower petals that had been covered in glitter from Clinton's, they were like half price, so they were a pound, so that'd be perfect if I was to ever make a rose jar. But yeah, I really want to uh, do that, so I can't get this out, but yeah, that's a rose, beautiful. Let's see if I can get this back in here. Like, I think a bell jar might be next on my list. Ooh. Oh, I'm not sure what this could be. I'm looking for scissors because I'm struggling. I 
I might just rip it because it's tissue paper. Royal besties. <laughs> Little bell rubber. Like, I always want to buy, like, cute rubbers, but I, like, I'll never use them. And then a little Disney princess, like, lunch bag. Um, I saw on Sarah's vlog that these were available and I haven't seen them in mine yet, so I'm quite excited to get this. I think that was the end of the box. Yeah. Oh, it's so cute. I absolutely love this. And this was from um, Happy Ever After Box, which I'll link everything below. But this is amazing. Like, I only bought the medium box just to see what it's like. And it's so good. I loved everything. So thank you so much, girls. And yeah, please do look and um, get and uh, ugh, check them out. <laughs> it's really late in my defence. It's midnight. Yay! <laughs> to get up and get ready for work. Yay! Do it all again tomorrow. But yeah, this has been great. Thanks, guys. Another thing I got in the post was this from Hannah Marie Magic. So I'm excited to see what these look like. Ooh. It's wrapped in like sparkly, not sparkly, like iridescent mermaid paper and then it's got like an aerial sticker on it there. I don't want to rip it so I'll just put it around. Ooh! Disney paper and sparkly confetti, like Mickey heads and stars, like you get from the Disney store, but not the stars, obviously. Get the little confetti out. Oh, these are beautiful. I love them. Got some Lady and the Tramp ears. Like, Lady and the Tramp is so underrated. Like, it definitely doesn't get enough credit. And I cannot wait to wear these in Disneyland. And they feel quite comfy, like, I've got some Disneyland ears, and after a while I had to take them off in Disneyland because they just really hurt my head. Like, it was tight, but these feel like I could wear them all day, which is great. I'm just so excited to debut in them in the park. I hope you've enjoyed watching this as much as I've enjoyed making it. I've got some really amazing things, and I'm quite lucky um, to have got the ones that I wanted. Um, pretty much straight away, which is quite cool. Um, so thank you guys for watching, and I uh, hope you're having a magical day. Bye guys.